As our work in early childhood has evolved and expanded, four main pillars have emerged. The law is slowly coming to an end. I see some hands raised in the other room. <laughs> All right, thank you. As our work in early childhood has evolved and expanded, four main pillars have emerged that encompass what we do at ISDs and how we support the work in early childhood and into K-12. So I'd like to draw your attention to your program. And in the middle, you have a graphic with a bridge that have four main pillars. So our first pillar one being that birth to three services and supports. Um, we've outlined some of the programs that we receive either state or federal funding for, and you may have others in your communities that align with the pillars as well. So calling out early on in some of our home visiting programs. Pillar two is really focused around our work in pre-K through the Great Start Readiness Program, Strong Beginnings, and our early childhood special education programs. Pillar three is where our early childhood systems building lives. This is the work of our Great Start collaboratives, our family coalitions, some of our uh, system-wide initiatives around literacy um, and talking is teaching. And pillar four is really that whole child family success uh, system building. So thinking about the whole child comprehensive services, our community partnerships, and the activities that we do bridging from birth to 26. So as we move forward this morning, our next presenters will help tell the story of each of these pillars through story and video, and they'll let us know how our role as ISDs help define the work and how we can move the work forward.